stay focused here and let's work hard. Our hustle was a lot better this morning than it is right now. Hey, that time I beat him, okay? I got, I got, to, I got, I got the whistle there. I got the pressure back, okay? Where's my partner? Downstairs. Downstairs? Oh, yeah. So, right, right, last time I got the pressure back, I got to my changeover. This time, he beats me off the whistle and gets, just bumps me forward, okay? I can't get, I can't keep that weight on my hands. I can't keep the weight on my hands, okay? If I continue to let it here, it's not gonna be good, okay? So I anticipate that, and when he knocks me forward, it's, it's just a little step. It's not a step forward, okay? That's not a good position, okay? It's just a little step outside, right here, and right about here, right under my nose, okay? I gotta slide that knee. I gotta slide that knee, okay? So I'm gonna use his pressure on this one, knocking me forward to knee slide up and keep my hips under me. Remember, we want our, always want our hips under us in wrestling, pretty much, right? When we're on the bottom, when we're on our shots, we want our hips, we don't want to be extended, okay? He gives me a little jolt, it's, a little, it's, it's just a little shift, knee slide. And this one comes up, okay? This is an outside leg stand up now. Now, notice, I still haven't grabbed his hands, and you guys won't see me grab his hands ever until I have my hips out, okay? And if you need a reminder, okay, these wrist tilts we worked yesterday. That's why I don't want to grab hands. Okay? My help, I'm fine with my elbows. Okay, right here I'm gonna push myself up. Okay? Right here, I'm gonna turn that hip out. He's gonna still be trying to hang on. I'm gonna turn that hip out. I'm gonna just push that hand away, keep my elbow in though. I don't want him to get that wrist. And a big cut right here. This elbow, this knee are on a line. They're on a string together. So when my elbow cuts, my leg cuts through the hole, and I keep my head in front. Okay? Biggest mistake a lot of guys make when they get away, okay? They get away, they say, go oh, they try to do this. Okay? And, and, and that's what happens. They get driven back down. I mean, even good guys, good college wrestlers, they'll be like right here, and then they'll, and they'll do this. Okay? I gotta cut away. I gotta get my feet away. I gotta get my hand and my head in front in case that reattack comes. So right here, okay? Cut away, head in front. Okay? Head in front. Watch when my arm goes down if he tries to follow. Okay? So I got it here. He's gonna try to follow. I keep my arm in front. Okay? One more time. He knocks me forward. Little Little, little dog, dog leg, okay? Little dog leg, you know what a dog does? Right there, fire hydrant, yeah, okay? He jolts me, right there, slide it up, slide it up. I'm pinching here, I'm not grabbing, I'm not grabbing, I'll end up here, I'm not grabbing. Push back, I turn my hip, my, my hip out, my shoulder into him, cut away. See my feet? Exaggerate. Don't turn here. Okay? Which foot do I have to get away from it? Huh? Both of them. Yeah, both of them. Okay? Watch them. Gonna, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be back there. Okay? Then I can move back in, get my position, and try to work him to get my tie up, my attack. Okay? Does that make sense? Have him jolt you forward just a little bit. Give that knee slide. Look at that big chest and head up. Okay? If I'm right here, it's not gonna work. Right here. Press him back. Press him back. His pressure will stand the other. Okay? Height. Or a standard cutaway. Okay, let's go.